So Multify just dropped on Cydia. This is Jeff with iDownload Blog. No doubt you probably already downloaded it. You're probably playing with it right now. But I wanted to talk about one new feature that came to Multify that I haven't covered before, and that is automatic keyboard expansion. So let me show you on my iPhone because I can really show you well here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to launch an application with Multify's interface, and I'm going to show you this new feature. So let's launch the stock Twitter app. All right, and we'll just wait for that to load up. All righty. So let's, um, actually, first of all, let's go ahead and just tone it down a little bit, make it small using edit mode. And let's launch another app first. So we're gonna launch the calculator app. All right, and then we'll just put that in edit mode, make that small. And now I have two apps and both of them are really, really small on my iPhone 6 Plus here. Now the Twitter app, if I wanted to compose a new tweet, I can tap in the new compose button. But previously, when you try to compose a new tweet or anything that required a keyboard, the keyboard was just really, really small. But now watch what happens when you tap in a text input field and invoke the keyboard. Look at that it auto expands the interface so that the keyboard is basically full screen. That way you can easily type. And once you close out of the keyboard interface, it goes right back down to size. Isn't that really cool? So now you don't have to worry about trying to use like a toothpick or something to type on the screen. Now you can type like normal, just like this. Multify is awesome. Alrighty. So when I close out here, automatically compresses just like that. Folks, this is Multify. It is out right now. If you haven't seen the full review, make sure you check out the full review where I walk through all the features of Multify. And folks, let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Are you using Multify? Sound off and let me know. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.